Well, Matt, we keep hearing that this could be one of the closest statewide races, and we'll just have to find that out tonight. We are here at the elections watch party for Rochelle Garza. We're being told it's going to be an intimate event, just friends, just family. We're also being told there's going to be a mariachi band at some point playing tonight. Now, Garza, we want to show you some pictures from earlier today. Garza has spent the last several months uh, campaigning on that campaign trail. Today's a big day for her. Today's a big day also for her family. You know, voting for the Garza family, we've learned, is a tradition. They always vote together. They even brought their six-month-old with them. Now, the baby has been on the campaign trail, as we've been told. Now, Rochelle Garza started off as an unknown uh, candidate. She's a, a young civil rights attorney from the Rio Grande Valley. Her platform has been reproductive rights, protecting Texans as consumers. She calls herself a, a fronteriza, which translates to the border. She is a product of that border. That's what she says. She is fighting for a humane approach to immigration reform. She is going up against Ken Paxton, as Matt Howerton has just said, who has the experience, a track record as well, but a checkered legal past and present. Right now we have someone in office who puts politics over people, who puts political grandstanding over everyday folks and families. And that's, that's what I'm here to combat. This will be an uphill battle. The question will be, can she pull enough conservative, moderate conservatives? And we'll find that out tonight.